Alright guys, what is going on? Fly here. Welcome back to the channel. Today's video by popular man. Uh, we're taking out the, the, uh, the Zao. Z-A-O. Yeah, I think I can do that one. Zao, the tier 10 Japanese cruiser. <laughs> this is so scripted right now, but isn't she just beautiful? Hang on, let's get back into the action. Alright, so we're versing a North Carolina and a Phoenix, not Phoenix, a um, Lexington class. So what that pretty much means right now is that our team has decided just to full on go ham um, to the. Do we have do we have N1K right there, guys? Look, what are with these epic scout planes? Look at that, it's a fucking N1K. Let's go ahead and launch her, because no one's launching their scout. We'll launch ours um, because there's a carrier. There's a you know pretty decent battleship on the enemy team. We're gonna go ahead and rush them. Um, we do have some pretty darn good carriers. This is this is gonna be a carrier showdown or a, a cruiser showdown here very soon. Here comes the um, dive bombers and torpedo bombers. Okay. So anyway, talking about the Zhao. Uh, we, uh, after this gameplay, we'll go into the hangar or the port and talk a little bit more about her. Uh, but we're rolling with four turrets. Each have three um, eight-inch guns or 203 millimeters. Can you stop? Holy crap. This thing likes the list, don't it? So I think what we're going to do is the... Come on, if, if we had two... Wait, who's about right behind us? All right. Uh... I wish I had a uh, Megami with us, because that would make things a lot easier. Okay, so we're, we're scouting right now. Um, and as you guys know, we can't really control our scouts, because we're gaming things for fucking, like, I don't know, sheep. So we have to wait until this scout plane circles behind my ship and then goes in front of me again for things to be kind of semi-spotted. Um, okay, they, they look like, like they're going to be fighting on the left side, so I'm going to move in a little bit. If we can catch their carrier off, off guard, then um, I, think, I think we can win this. Because I can easily take on a North Carolina. Me, me and this New Orleans can easily fuck a, new, a North Carolina up, no problem. Especially with the AP. Yeah, so in my uh, Baltimore video, I was shooting a lot of HE. And I think that's just because I played a lot of Phoenix and a lot of Omaha. Um, back in, Not back in the day, but while grinding to the Cleveland. And the Cleveland still heat. Not heat, but high explosive, so... I need to get off my uh, old ways, and I think in this gameplay, we might... I'm going to be loading... Oh, God, look at that reload. Eight seconds. We're going to be loading HT for the first shot, and then we're going to be moving to our AP at second or third. Okay, I'll move in a little bit more here. We're, we're, we're going to take a drastic action right now. Because if we can start targeting their carrier, then they're going to have to pull off their assault um, to our base, unless they want to leave their carrier to die, which I'm hoping they will. But if you look at the top speed, we're about to be pushing 34 knots. Yeah, there we go. 34 knots top speed, pretty much. Now, I'm, I'm sure I, I um, the upgrades I have on this are mostly with the guns and um, damage controls. No, no really speed upgrades, at least the, at least the commander. Okay. Um, and we aren't flying a flag today. We might fly a flag next battle. We got to really fucking cut in right now, man. They are... <laughs> I thought they would be over here by now. Isn't she fucking gorgeous, boys? Look! Look at how hydrodynamic she is. I know it's a ship, I know it just... Oh, it's so beautiful. You know what I wish in this game? What, what they had? A, a, a bigger wake and a longer trail of, like, it's water, but I know that might take a hit on some systems, but... Come on, 2015. You can uncheck it or check it. Okay, Tango. There's a North Carolina class. I don't know if I want to shoot him yet because I don't think I'm spotted. Eh. Oh, she's so beautiful. Is it? Her guns aren't looking at me yet. On the way. A little bit short, but we might get a hit. All right, this North Carolina is going to be going down soon. Let's go ahead and get her, get, get her on fire. Here comes the AP. Oh my God, stuck. I think I, I think she's looking at me right now.
We got, we got, uh oh, we're gonna, we're gonna take a big hit right here, boys. There we go, 6,000 on her. That New Orleans can do that again. The New Orleans is a Citadel fucking machine. We're gonna pull off now, we got one more hit in there. Another 6,000, oh my gosh, these APs are scary. We're gonna get one more salvo on her. That might be enough. Got some nice dodges going on from this New Orleans. Oh, come on, shells. Put them in. Oh, 3,000. These, these last ones might be it. Okay, North Carolina is dead. Roger that. This New Orleans is now running away. That was a hard sacrifice, but good sacrifice at the same time. Um, I feel like our battleships need to go defend... Or maybe we need to turn around. Where is that fucking Lexington, man? I thought I thought we, we would get a jump on her. Okay, turning her around. The 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 Zhao is a beautiful dodging ship. Oh, well, I do have the rudder shift upgrade that makes it a lot easier. That Zhao is probably. I mean, that that Lexington's probably up there. Defend cap. Defend cap. Let's see what the team wants to do. We're gonna turn our guns around to the right. Stay in cap and maneuver casual. So it looks like our team is going to cap, which is kind of boring for me. Um, but what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna let them cap, but I'm gonna go back and fight off the enemy team from our cap so I can delay it. Because if we all go for cap, you know, oh, I thought that was a enemy planes. If we all go for cap, it can potentially uh, lead, up, lead into a bad situation. We actually have a pusher right now. The Megami class. Very scary ship. Tier 8. We got, we got AP on her. Oh, beautiful shots too. Oh, no. A little bit too in front, but they might actually connect. Oh my god. Yep, they connected. Bat guns are now turning into the fight. Megami's dead. Uh, here comes the Nolans. Nolans will get some far shots into him. Don't know how they'll land, though. Yeah, he wants my ass, man. I'll tell you that. Incoming, incoming. Everything's incoming. Get rid of those torpedo bombers. That is... Come on, anti-aircraft. Let's get them. Torpedoes, direct front. Direct front. Oh, yep, they're dropped. Fuck. Okay, we have a fucking Omaha here. Pensacola. I think we're gonna win this. Took down three planes in that whole engagement. I feel like anti aircraft so short sometimes. Alright, hit a citadel. What a beast of a ship, guys. With that reload rate, it is phenomenal. A little bit too high for the citadels on the Pensacola, but fuck me, man. I think this game, this game has cruisers down pat, man. There's nothing. I mean, sure, the fire potential is a little bit still um, too much, but I should, yeah, World of Cruisers might be a good name, too. Uh, we got second on the team. Oh, well, we got first on the team. Uh, first in the game, we got about 50, you know, 53,000 damage. Um, a nice, that, that North Carolina was just, I think, just strung out in a poor area in the battle. He had really no support, as you guys saw. We, everyone was fighting on him. Every salvo, every salvo that I shot over there was doing 6,000, which is amazing. So yeah, overall, pretty fun game. We're just, we're just gonna go over the ship a little bit and show you what I'm rolling with, and then um, we'll hop in another one. Now, we only killed three ant we only killed three planes that round, um, but we have 20, 20 single, or yeah, 20 single uh, 25 millimeters. 11 quad tw or 11 trip uh, 25 millimeters, so 33 guns on this. And then we have Bow Force. Chi. <laughs> Don't worry. Uh, we run out of game gun name. Just add Chi, make it Japanese. Um, I don't think the Japanese manufactured Bow Force, but um, 
They definitely did capture some, but they were called a Type 5, not the Type 98. But it's wargaming, and I and I you know I like wargaming a lot. And here's our here. These are the dual purposes: second Ares and anti-aircraft. And in that battle, as you guys saw, we were doing about 8,000, some pretty intense um, damage to the enemy ships. And these are um, thanks to these uh, uh, four by three eight-inch guns, 203 millimeters fire rate. Um, I believe, hang on, where is it? Here it is. Of 4.4 rounds a minute. So that's saying that we could potentially do, if well, not counting citadels, just counting normal hits, about 20,000 damage plus a minute, almost 30. So insanely um, good rate of fire. Guns do rotate super slow. I really don't have any upgrades on that other than my commander. Um, with that, and as you guys see, I usually go for damage control over anything. Um, I love damage. And yeah, and the thing is, I have all the anti-aircraft upgrades pretty much, but we only shot down one or three. It's amazing. It's like, and um, the the worst thing as you play these games more and more, guys, you'll start to realize the really stupid, like, meta. Well, I don't I don't know what you call it meta, but sure, these these planes come in, they fly right at you, right, and your anti-aircraft's missing, 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 and then after they drop the bombs. Your anti-aircraft shoots them down like, I don't know, like a, uh, a, a heat-seeking missile. Like, they go down like that, but when, when they have their bombs on them, they don't go down until they drop them. Um, and now, let me just look at this again. I didn't even really mention this or do this in the game at all, because I'm so used to American cruisers. We have torpedoes. I think they're in the back. We have, oh my gosh, that's insane. So we have um, four by five. What, we have four? Oh, I think we have three turrets with four by... No. Where's the fourth one at? What the fuck? Am I tripping? Yeah, wait. No, this is definitely three. I don't know this is what they're talking about. So four by five would mean that there'd be four turrets with five torpedoes in them, right? Anyways, we have torpedoes on each side. Um, so here's one. This is the worst presentation of these torpedoes I could. Yeah, we, we already seen that one. I don't know how to figure out in battle, but we have eight kilometer torp range. Um, here are the upgrades for today. We have the non-detonation of the main batteries, uh, anti-aircraft upgrade, main battery shortening or um, reload time is much less. We have damage control, we have rudder shift, and we have concealment, which is really good for sneaking up on a target. Look at our concealment. We are at 12.6 kilometers, um, so we can sneak all the way up to a ship at 12.6 and unleash our torpedoes, potentially, if they're coming towards us, and uh, the torpedoes might connect, but pretty much with the... Sorry it's taking so long, guys. I just like to talk about these ships. Um, but mainly with these torpedoes, I think, th think these are like defensive torpedoes or line torpedoes. Kind of like in dire situations, you kind of use these. I mean, or, or you can set up traps, um, I'm sure. But with 8 kilometer range, if you get within 8 kilometer range of an enemy ship at tier 10, um, yeah, you're dead. But uh, definitely good defense. And look at this scout plane. On the Baltimore, we had like a souped up P-51, and now this one's like a, a key, a, 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 a N1K2. Shinden, Shindig, can you dig it? It's pretty crazy, but guys, let's go ahead and get into another one. Man, I love cruisers, guys. Fuck yeah. All right, guys, welcome to the second gameplay. Um, this is actually a pretty cool battle. We have a Hakuru. <laughs> I uh, am reversing a Yamato in Iowa, North Carolina, North Carolina, Colorado. So pretty much this will be a little bit more of a passive game, I feel like. We're going to have to embrace our carrier. I'm going to have to kind of defend the carrier at all costs. If we lose that carrier, I guarantee you we will lose the game. Absolutely no way can an enemy team lose when they have a, a Yamato, Iowa, North, North, and a Colorado with a Baltimore. If our cruiser or if our carrier is dead, they're going to sweep right through us. But without further ado, guys, we're going to go ahead and take a rightward approach in this map. Or left, depends if you're using the map to orient yourself or or the way I'm heading. Do you guys see that? Can you guys see the map? Yo, do, does, it, does anyone play it like this? They, they must get fucked so many times. There we go. Oh, another one of my pet peeves. 
I don't like how uh, the letters are on the right side of the map, not the left. That's that, 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 that's not how I read. I don't look over to the left to find information first. I look over to the... I don't, know, I don't look over to the right. I look over to the left first. You know? I don't know. Whatever. <clears throat> don't ignore the east flank, please. Can't all just lemming west. Good point. Roger that. We're going to turn in. I'm going to turn around. I don't want to be bitch. Because that carrier is over there. If they get in range of that carrier, he's still stationary. Oh, which is very... Uh, yep, looks like they're going east, so we're going to go ahead and rotate. God, look at these fucking guns, eh? Oh, yeah, I didn't put the camo on, guys. They, um, this, the, the Zhao has a pretty crazy camo. I honestly don't like the ship, the Japanese ship camos. Um... And honestly, I don't like any of the camos. Um, they do look cool, don't get me wrong, but I like looking at the ship. I, I love the Japanese, like, maho uh, mahogany colored deck. I know it's probably not mahogany, but um, it's just a beautiful deck color. Look at that North Carolina. Hey, BB. It's kind of funny because, like, you know that, that, that annoying phrase that everyone doesn't like, BB? But, like, now you can use it without being a douche because that was a BB, you know? I called Laura BB the other day. I was like... Hey, BB, she's like, shut the fuck up, man. I'm like, okay, sorry. Make me a sandwich, JK. I make myself sandwiches. Okay, so we're out of range right now. You know, we, we, we could be pretty gutsy right now and go down the middle. Here, okay, so let, let, let's do torpedoes right now. Two. Don't we had fucking three. I don't fucking know what's going on anymore. Oh my gosh, so we have four in total. Oh my god, man. How did I pass skew? But look at that torpedo barrage, eh? Devastating if we get in contact with a close battleship. We have a Nolens coming up down the middle. See, these games, um, these, these single cap games are like cool and all. But it's very passive play for quite a bit until everything gets kind of organized. But we have an Agami over here, a Hatsuru. The, ha the Hakuhuru. Is that how you say it? Hakuhuru. Hakuhuru. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so they're right over this mountain range right here, a volcano range. Nice passive play. Yeah, the carrier should get moving soon, but look how cool he looks. Oh, it doesn't... It, these, these like, late war carriers don't even look like they're supposed to float. And then once, like, nuclear carriers start to show up, you know, not in World of Wars, but just in the history, those things look like they should never have ever floated. They don't look right at all. Okay. Come on, gun, get on target here. This is actually a crucial shot right now. Oh, I'm trying to get over that point. Yamato... We're gonna wait for a reload. Launch our scout plane. So it looks like on cruisers, the scout plane does not increase range, but I don't really have a problem with it at all. We wanna just scare them off, allow more time for our carrier to get more ships and shit out. Or more planes, excuse me. Let's go ahead and turn out. Load one more shot of um, high explosive. Just see if I can catch anything on fire. Oh, torpedoes dropped. Okay, you know, I actually kind of feel semi-comfy to move in now. Oh, hi, Piper. Okay, that was from North Carolina. Incoming salvo. We're going to turn into these. Oh, yeah, he's fine right on me right now. so passive today. Looks like they've recognized where our mo most of our forces are going. We got shots in the Yamato. Oh man, that's a scary target, eh? Not every day you get shots on these guys. Thank <laughs> you. 
my gosh, I think that Magi just saved my life right there. Okay, onto the AP. Just trying to set, just set, get some things on fire, make kills a little bit easier in the long run. But I'm surprised we're actually pushing this team right now. There's only three of us over here, and there's like, well, granted, they're probably trying to defend their cap right now, but I thought they would push through earlier. North Carolina is going to open up. I'm going to catch him here for in range. Ooh, nice shots, Amagi. Yeah, yeah, dude, the Amagi is fucking scary, boys. Um, it did forty thousand damage to me um, in my Iowa. I don't, I don't, I don't know if you guys saw that video, but um, I was just—it was just the beginning of the game. And I was just talking shit, you know, like I'm gonna win this game. I really wasn't. But this Amagi just opens up and does forty thousand damage. I'm like, you what, mate? Yo, nice shots, dude. Nice shots, Amagi. Or Agami, sorry if I can't mispronounce it. Uh, Agami. Well, you know what? Fuck it, dude. I probably can't even spell anyways. What's, what? How, how do, yeah, 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 yeah. You know what, dude? I think he knows that he has good shots, so we're, we're gonna leave it at that. You know, fail team communication. Okay, who's over here? In Iowa. Wants me to wreck him right now? Wreck him? Oh, okay, he's dead. Wow, their team's falling. Their big battleships are now running away from the contest. Don't know where those torpedoes are going. There is a Yamato. The Yamato. Oh my god. Sagami's wrecking face right now. Now over to our left, which I, I, I want to commit for the uh, the Yamato, because if we can get him out of the game, then I don't think there's anything stopping us over here from pushing it at all. Nice shots in the New Orleans. Nothing really connected though. A little bit too low, maybe. So I think I'm gonna commit. Here we go. Otago. Amagi. Zhao. Or Zhou. Zhao. I think the, uh, the, the Yamato's about to open up here. There he goes, he's opening up for some good AP shells on target. And here we go. On the way. Oh, it's about to go down, boys. A little bit too far in front of these shots. Oh, God damn, is that a nasty salvo. Yeah, he's going down really quickly here. Beautiful shells. A little bit too high though. Fuck. Where's that 10,000 at again, dude? I want that 10,000. We got North Carolina shooting for me. Oh, these are gonna hurt, boys. Gonna turn into these things. Oh, okay. Well, we took really no damage right there at all. Come here, North Carolina. You hurt me. I hurt you. 
Bye bye. Have a good game. Yeah. Enemy battleship sunk. Those are, those are definitely citadels right there. Oh, hit two on him. Eleven thousand. So with this Yamato, I want to get him on fire right now. But I gotta save one more salvo for this uh, New Orleans in front of me. The New Orleans. Not capping, boys. Who the fuck caps, right? Oh, fuck. Okay. Loading it. HE for the uh, Yamato over to our uh, front left. Gonna keep it a little bit more to the uh, right here so we don't expose ourselves to these two ships that are pretty good health. Yamato is now repairing. Oh, he's on fire, boys. Yeah, he, he, he ain't gonna last too much longer. so much. I love these high tier ships, man. Or at least the high tier cruisers more than anything. They're so versatile. Too versatile for this magnitude. Yamato's going down. I want the kill in the Yamato. But hey, it's all in good. It's all in good teamwork. There's some good shots in the Citadel right destroyed. there. Trusting this guy in one hit, eh? One salvo. Oh yeah. I got him. GG boys. Oh, I want to keep playing more, but like, how much time do you guys have in a day to watch a video, huh? We got three garbage cleanup kills in that match. Um, but we got four Citadels, which is amazing. Uh, we got, damn, dude. They lost because of that fucking carrier, man. See, it's great when the carrier's on your side. I got nothing wrong with World of Warships when that happens. But I'll tell you right now, if you're going against it, it's like, fuck my life. But we got... Oh, it felt like we did a lot more damage than that, but we got uh, about 60,000 damage. Eh, about 59,000, but hey, you know who's counting. Um, if you guys want to see some more ships, vote in the comments below on what I take out next. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and until next time, peace out, guys.